Hey everybody, it's Charlie's Rest Air Kia Waukesha here again. I am still in the same 2024 Kia Sportage X-Line trim level that we just did a full vehicle uh, video walk around on and I wanted to briefly talk about some of the infotainment system features here So I have an iPhone and I did hook up my phone um, at least for the Bluetooth settings uh, For some examples for this video But this is the home screen of what the infotainment center is going to look like so you can click into this guy You'll see that there's a map um, you can see you know your, what's near you You can go back to the home screen with the main settings here as well by simply just clicking out of this um, you're gonna have a navigation menu right here as well so let's say you're on a road trip for example you can click this guy right here you're looking for the nearest gas stations nearest hotels perhaps because you're gonna be staying overnight um, trying to get some fast food some restaurants all of this is going to be capable um, through these settings here so let's say just for example let's click on gas stations and it's going to show you a whole bunch of gas stations of what's closest to us here i'm currently at rust air kia of waukesha and it's going to work the same exact way for all of these other settings here as well which is super nice phone so like i said i did hook up my phone here so you're going to see all the different my contacts right here full contacts list now you can also make calls simply make a make a dial right here click phone um, and then that's going to make a call to whoever's available and now text messaging ha it's not available why because that's illegal do not text and drive we do not support illegal things here at rust arrow kia waukesha and kia does not support illegal things either uh, so there will be no texting and driving here phone projection is going to be the next one here so i do need the the cable port to cook up to the full apple carplay android auto capabilities i am hooked up to the bluetooth settings right now which is really cool because even through that you can still play whatever music you want to listen to um, podcasts um, you name it voice memo let's click on this guy right here um, so there's not a whole lot to go on there but you can certainly create a voice memo if you would like here as well climate settings so you can control the climate settings through this here as well or you can simply control the climate settings down here we have it set up um, right here as well so it's on sync right now i can uh, change the settings right now by twisting this knob making the temperature hotter or colder or if i simply twist this knob it's going to desync it and then the passenger can either be warmer or colder depending on whatever your preference is there but like i said you can also do that through uh this setting right here on the infotainment center we're not going to really talk about uh much of these here at all but uh the radio we can click into that so this will be give you xm um sorry am fm xm radio options here as well so you can play you can also listen to the radio even if you are hooked up to your phone here as well if you prefer the radio versus the bluetooth options and then we can click into media here as well and i just have like an a-list pop thing on uh a-list an a-list pop hits music thing going on on apple music here so that's just going to be auto auto playing whatever's uh coming up next here just for example um, and then lastly, the setup option here. So here you can see more options about your vehicle, the driver assistance, um, different light options. So the high beam assist is gonna be on. So the brights will automatically turn off if you're approaching uh, somebody with your brights on, you're probably gonna want that on. You'll have different options here and you can kind of just click through and, and read the different options here. If you wanna click uh, the lock button once and have that unlock just the driver's door and then you press it the second time, it uh, that would then unlock every other door here as well. This will automatically allow the power lift gate to go up and down. Convenience here, lights, which we clicked on before we talked about the, uh, the climate settings already. And Let's go back to, to that guy here. So with the, with the setup option here, you're also going to be able to change the date and time if you would like at all from here as well. Um, gives you different uh, information on the system right here with different storage and that kind of stuff. But you're, you're not going to really have to worry about storage on this. Um, obviously, most people watching this are probably going to be on an English language here um, as well. And different keyboard options here. <laughs> if you want to switch from... Uh, uh, Fahrenheit to Celsius or miles to kilometers you can uh, you can certainly do that here as well and then you can go just to a full factory reset here at the bottom it restores everything in the vehicle back to its original factory settings for example if you were about to sell the vehicle um, but that's kind of a brief walk around here too as well and even if the vehicle does not have a necessarily navigation right because not every single vehicle is going to be equipped with navigation you can hook up to the apple carplay android auto the apple carplay android auto is actually going to pop up um, 
the apps on your phone. So one of those is gonna be Apple Maps. So you could just navigate through your Apple Maps, let's say if you had an iPhone and get to your whatever destination you're looking for through there without having an actual Kia factory installed navigation system. Apple CarPlay uh, can certainly help you out there as well as Android Auto. I just have an Apple um, or an iPhone, so I'm using that as an example. But that's kind of a brief overview here of the infotainment system here. Again, I don't have a USB port, so we're not, we, I can't hook up the full um, Apple CarPlay, Android Auto um, systems here. But that's about it for this one. This is the Kia uh, Sportage 2024 X-Line trim level. If you guys would like to set up an appointment, take a look at this vehicle, call us here, 262-444-5445. Um, you can ask to speak to sales. Otherwise, stay safe out there and have a great day, everybody.